the title of this mini podcast is Your Favorite Teacher. Did you ever have a favorite teacher? I did. He was my 10th grade biology teacher, Mr. Coletta. He had us call him by his first name, Rich. Rich had an interesting method of teaching, especially when it came to testing. The day before a test, he would put the test questions up on the board. That meant you knew in advance what the questions were going to be. He encouraged you to research the answers and write them out that night so that the information would be fresh in your mind the next day. There was really no excuse not to do well on the test outside of pure laziness or indifference. His method involved rehearsal versus rote. And his method involved a number of senses, including the kinesthetic sense of physically writing out the answers as practice. It was quite ingenious for the time. I had another teacher as an adult who taught me more about rehearsal, Dr. Dave Dobson. Dave taught us this wonderful exercise of rehearsing yourself in calm and collected feelings. It goes something like this. Can you think of a time that you felt calm and collected? Go back to that time in your mind. Involve as many of your senses as you can. What does it look like to be calm and collected? Sound like? Feel like? Smell and taste like? To be calm and collected for you. Rehearse yourself in those feelings so you know exactly what it feels like to be calm and collected. Continue this rehearsal so you can produce these feelings at a moment's notice. Next, Imagine a situation where you had some feelings come up that put you on edge. The minute you begin to experience those feelings, immediately bring to mind the calm and collected feelings you rehearsed yourself in. Rehearse the switching exercise over and over again until you become adept at it. The result of this mental practice is that your mind will automatically throw the switch for you. That means you'll be able to respond appropriately and offer yourself more choices when tense feelings come up. Just like with my high school teacher's method, you have to do the rehearsal to do well on the test. So I wonder how soon you'll do this homework assignment and reap the benefits of rehearsal taught by two of my favorite teachers. All the best, John.